Chinese scientists just fired a laser at the moon. Scientists at the Deep Space Exploration Laboratory fired the laser across 80,000 miles of space in broad daylight, hitting their target a half metre wide Tandu-1 satellite, currently orbiting around the moon. This achievement in precision aiming is the equivalent to hitting something the width of a human hair from 6.2 miles away. This activity was carried out as part of a satellite laser ranging study, which is the gold standard for pinpointing objects in orbit. Scientists fired nanosecond laser pulses at the satellite, which is equipped with retroreflectors. These bounce the light back to Earth, and by measuring the time it takes for the light to return, scientists can calculate an object's position hundreds of thousands of kilometers away to within centimeter level precision. And that is hard at the best of times, but this detects was done during the day, and detecting this incredibly weak signal against the background of the light coming from the sun is an incredible achievement. By overcoming the challenge of solar interference, China can now ensure continuous navigation and communication between the Earth and the Moon, providing high-precision landing guidance and facilitating near-real-time coordination of rover fleets on the Moon's surface. This technology is poised to play a central role in approach descent and landing systems for China's future missions, particularly those targeting the lunar South Pole. All this lend incredible credibility to the age-old saying that if you shoot for the moon, you might just hit a Chinese satellite. If you like science and just heard a Bond villain slow clapping the whole time I was talking, follow for more.